Okay, so, we are now back at the Bureau, as of which, ironically, the final citizen we saved here in the poor district of Acre, we actually were only about a few metres away from the Bureau itself. So, let's now speak to the leader of the Assassin's Bureau here in Acre. Ah, Altai. A little bird told me you'd be paying a visit. Al Mualam has ordered the execution of Gagne de Naprus, and so here I am. What can you tell me about him? He is the Grand Master of the Knights Hospital, and surely keeps his quarters in their district. Beyond that, I cannot say. I suggest you search the city. See what you can learn from the people. Tell me where they gather, and I'll see what I can find. The public gardens north of here, or what's left of them, are as good a place as any to begin. There's an abandoned market northwest as well that merits watching. And Maria of Jehoshaphat's church to the west remains a popular meeting place. These three locations should be sufficient for your needs. I appreciate the information, Rafiq. It will be put to good use. See that it is. Okay, so I think the name of the man here is called Rashik if I am not mistaken, and also if I heard that correctly. But, we now have some investigations to get on with, and as of which, I think because the two nearest to me are technically pickpocket missions, I shall do those first. So, going to do the pickpocket missions first, as of which we have two of those to do here. And, because I know they are the closest, that is what I shall do first. And so, heading over here, and now we just need to listen in on their conversation. I need this dealt with now. The ropes are eaten through with rot and must be replaced. If we wait any longer, we risk an accident. I understand, but what of the houses I'm supposed to repair? Never mind the citizens. What do they do anyway but cry and complain? It's the knights who sacrifice that the rest of us might live in peace. But they've nowhere to go, and the rains will come soon. I won't warn you again, boy. Do as you're told or you'll find yourself in irons. Yes, sir. First sensible words out of your mouth. You've got the plans now. Get to work! Okay. Let's get a move on. But, just in case, I need to switch over to the fists so I don't kill him. And so, this is my target. There we go. I guess all I really need to do in order to be successful is to press L1 and hold circle. L1 of course to lock on the target and then basically R1 sorry and then basically just need to hold down circle just to make it so I am successful in pulling off the pickpocket. So, heading over here, and all I have to do now is find out where the other one is located. And... Oh, oh, that's convenient. And... There is something over there, but I'm not going to collect it just yet. Because I want to try and avoid the bonus items until I've decided it's time for me to uh, collect them. Leave, peasant. And officially trying to get myself off the roof as quickly as I can. And heading down here. This is a great location 
to heads. Come see what I have to offer. I've many things. Many things. I've too many things. So Unless the other pickpocketer is literally inside the building. And thankfully there are no guards here, so we can just get on with this. So what you got there? Rubbish. The man had no coin to speak of, just some damn tube. All I found was a bit of paper with these nonsense scratchings. Them's not nonsense, but words and letters. Why is a man putting words and letters in a tube? The way it's a tube, if you ask me. Must be important. Give it here, and I'll have a look. Like you helped last time. I ain't letting you steal this. Well, ain't you clever. Have fun with it, then. Okay. And going back to fists once again, so I do not cause a murder. And all I have to do now is just get close enough to pickpocket the man. Acquired letter, which shows the connection of Garnier and two other men. So, we can now, of course, doing... We can now, of course, get on, of course, with the assassination of Garnier, but... Obviously, since I am going for 100%, I need to do the other investigations first. Which, personally... I do think is one of the best things I can do. I also don't want to cause a stir up with the guards, as of which one area is unguarded and the other one is guarded, so... Yep, okay. I just had to run into one of the guards. I just had to do that. Just to show my insolence. I have escaped. Yeah. Good escape. Well, not necessarily good because, well, I still attracted attention, but sure, whatever. But whatever. A few coins, all I ask for is put a few coins. Let's now get on with our investigation mission. Which I think is somewhere over here. And trying to get away from the peasants. As of which there are a lot of peasants around here. There's also a lot of thugs. Which I will probably deal with later because, well... Once we get the throwing knives back, I should probably mention... We can pickpocket them for knives. Technically speaking, of course. And... I just need to head over here. And now, now I just need to lock onto him. A promise he won't betray. Soon, my friends, soon the good doctor will attend to your needs. Be patient, hold hope close. There are many in need of aid, and only one of him. He works tirelessly to serve and save, but these things take time. Okay, so let's now follow him over to a location and basically give him a beating before he reveals the information he may have. Or whatever information he may have in his grasp and we basically need him to give it to us. But also we need to make sure we're not attracting too many attention to the guards. Stop following me. And apparent as it might be, she had to give away my cover. And I 
trying to lose her and trying to head over here okay I think she is gone and so now it's time for me to give him the beating because he has information that we need mercy mercy don't kill me I'll do anything you want you serve Gagne he he makes me say these things to keep the people from revolting to give them hope and make them eager for his touch tell me everything you can about the man y yes of course I, I I know what happens within what he really does go on not sick not wounded when they enter but once he's got his hands on them then the pain begins he's no healer then just a sick cruel man I, I don't know what it is he does to make them cry so loud but it must be stopped before more are made to suffer will you stop him it's why you still live he is cautious you must pick the proper time go to him when he attends to the patients he forgets the world around him becomes lost in his work yes strike then I thank you for the information then you'll let me go would that I could Yeah, that's becoming very typical, by the way. Who did this? And so, walking away before the guards can take any notice. And so, the next mission I'll head over to is an informer mission. Although apparently I'm now appearing to be walking away from that. But, I am, however... Oh fuck. Yep. I just had to make the U-turn. And expose myself. Because I am an idiot. Anyways. I have my sword out just in case. You were not allowed to be and now I have some bloodshed to do. I don't plan on running forever. And... Yep, okay, that failed. Well, anyways, anyways, back to my usual rooftop sprinting, which is more or less what I appear to be doing, and just need to head over here, and... I don't know if anyone's behind me or not, but if they are, then well. Yep, okay. Let's see if I can manage to. Oh, okay. And apparently that's now our second Templar down. And, apparent as it might be, that's now our second Templar defeated. Oh, fuck. And... Still trying to defeat these guards. And now that should be all of them, including another Templar, which I had to defeat in the process. Anyways, let's now speak to the Informer. Altair, he's after me. He saw me. He will kill me and my wife and children. What a mess. Have you come to end my misery? No. Al-Mualim has more compassion than I thought. 
Could you help me then? A knight of the Hospitalier is after me. If you could eliminate him, you would do a fellow a real honor. I've been here in Akka since the Crusaders were laying siege. I can give you important information in return. Okay. So, we basically need to assassinate a target who is going after the informer. I also have to make sure I'm not being followed by the guards, which is another thing that uh, needs to come into consideration. Of course, these guards will be informed very quickly if they are together. And there, of course, is my target. And all I have to do now is try and keep her away from me. Can I please just get on with my job at hand? Okay, there we go. The target is down. All I have to do now is make sure I do not cause any attention with the guards, because if I do, then the mission has failed. But hopefully they will not notice the one who did it. And basically trying to blend in for a moment here, because, well, these, of course, are guards. I don't want to expose myself too soon. I would like to get this mission over and done with. And, of course, we do have some guards. This is probably not the best place to enter. So... I shall head over here instead, where I will not be taking up quite as much attention. And all I have to do now is try and get back to the informer. Although I will need to climb up the wall to do it, though. So, yeah. This could be potentially difficult. And there we go. It is done. He's dead. Oh, I am extremely grateful. So, here is what I know about Garni de Naplus, Grand Master of the Hospitalier. Garni lets his patients roam the halls of his fortress. No one, save scholars, may enter his personal workspace and the rooftops are guarded by archers. I'm sure this information will help deliver Garni to the gates of hell. Okay, thank you. None may enter none may enter the fortress. Save for scholars and guards. And it looks as though the guards will still be looking for attention, so I'm gonna have to try and keep my eyes on those guards and make sure they do not follow me because that could be catastrophic if they do Stop the oh, oh shit I had a feeling this was gonna happen yeah I was just waiting for it and something tells me there might be another Templar for me to kill which is a good thing, because, well... Anyways, landing in with the Scholars. Since I did just manage to lose the guards. And now they cannot see me. And now I can exit the blend and try to at least see if I can get the eavesdropping done last time here. So, pressing on to L1, and now we need to listen in to their conversation. You hear about Elaine? The archer who guards the eastern wing? Poor bastard's brother caught an arrow in the throat. 
doubt he'll last the night. How can he continue to work, knowing what's to come? He visits his brother often, so I cover for him when I can. You aren't there now? No. I have family business of my own to attend to. Then he'd best hope the doctor doesn't learn of his desertion. He won't. Long as you stay silent. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. There are some fortress roof guards absent from patrol duty. Okay. So, we just have one investigation left over. And then we need to... Head back to Rasik in order to officially tell him what we know from the information we could find. So, doesn't look as though these guards are really interested in me at the moment, which is a good thing. And all I have to do now is head down to wherever the informer is. So, not got much further to go. Just need to head over here. He must not be of sound mind. And now no, please, don't be I have an informer's task to get on with. And there he is. If it isn't Altair, remember me? No? I learned my craft at the same time as you. Still, no memories of me. Doesn't matter. Al Mualim has charged me with a mission that I am honored to perform. I must test you. What a pleasure. I have hidden flags in this area. Find them and return to me. Be quick. It is such a shame that the old man insisted that I must help you if you succeed. Okay, we just need to find these 20 flags of Messiah, which were originally given to whoever this guy is. But of course, we need to collect those flags in order to obtain the information. So that's what I'm doing. I need these flags in order to officially gain valuable information that could help me out in succeeding with the assassination of Garnier. And we also have three minutes to get this task done, so that technically means we are on a time limit, of course. I have done this in under three minutes before, there's no reason that says I cannot do it again. It's just a matter of knowing how I'm going to do it. Which I think is the real question marker. And so... We continue. And... Still, I continue with my task of ultimately trying to obtain every single one of these flags. Three flags remain, and now we just need to return to our informer. He was right over there. And we do it in just under a minute to spare. Back. I'm impressed. Not enough to change my mind about you. But since Al Muelim commands, here is what I know about your next target. Garnier hides in the Hospitalier Fortress. Getting into the fortress will require cunning. That's all I have for you. Okay. Garnier secludes himself within his fortress walls. So, all we have to do now is head back over to the Assassin's Bureau, which is not too far from here, 
I'm just going to run across the rooftops anyway. And... I also need to make sure that... The enemy does not follow me whilst I am here. Because, well, to do so would compromise the Brotherhood. And... Trying to make it through the crowds. And... We have succeeded in that mission. All we have to do now is try and see if we can get into the bureau itself. And this is pretty much where I'm heading. So the bureau entrance is right over there. And now we shall inform Rasik of what information we have obtained. Altair, how fares your search for Garnier? I know when and how to strike. Share your knowledge with me then. He lives and works within the Order's hospital, northwest of here. Rumors speak of atrocities committed within its walls. It seems the good doctor enjoys experimenting on innocent citizens, most of them kidnapped and brought here from Jerusalem. Clever. By stealing his subjects from another city, he avoids arousing too much suspicion here. But back to the matter at hand. What is your plan? Gagne keeps mainly to his quarters inside the hospital, though he leaves occasionally to inspect his patients. It's when he makes his rounds that I will strike. It's clear you've given this some thought. I give you leave to go. Remove this stain from Akka, Altai. Perhaps it will help cleanse your own. Rest here until you're ready to begin your mission. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Okay. Strike Garnier while he is tending his patients for he removes himself from the world around him. Okay. So we've done all of the necessary investigation shit. Pretty much done all the investigations I can do to make this a perfect 100%. And so, this is now where I shall head. And using the rooftops, honestly don't care if the guards do or don't spot me. I just want to make it over to the fortress, at least undead, not necessarily uninjured, but undead at the very least, because the rooftops are ultimately the best entrance I can use to get into the fortress, or in other words, to penetrate the fortress. This is pretty much what my plan is, and now I am heading up... Oh, that's not where I need to be. So, heading over here, and climbing up the walls, because that is what I do. And, I think there should be an entrance... Oh, correction, I can see a ladder from here. So that is what I shall use. I shall use the ladder which I see from up above. And something tells me I'm going to have to try and make it across. Okay, I've managed to escape the sight. Of the guard, of course, there is another one that I'll have to deal with. Of course, that's one guard I'm gonna have to deal with. There was nothing I could have done there to prevent that from taking place. And so, I am now in the fortress. Help me! 
Enough, my child. I asked you to retrieve the patient, not to kill him. There, there. Everything will be all right. No! Give me no. your hand. Don't touch me! Not again! Cast out this fear, else I cannot help you. Help me? Like you helped the others? You took their souls! I saw. I saw! But not mine. No! You'll not have mine! Take hold of yourself. Do you think this gives me pleasure? Do you think I want to hurt you? But you leave me no choice. Every kind word matched by the back of his hand. All lies and deception. He won't be content until all bow before him. You should not have done that. Return him to his quarters. I'll be along once I've tended to the You others. can't keep me here. I'll escape again. No, you won't. Break his legs, both of them. I am so sorry. Have you people nothing better to do? Okay. And I can probably say Garnier's subjects here have pretty much been, I guess you could say, zombified. Because that's more or less what the subjects here basically are. They are more or less... They are more or less the very fact that we're having this conversation Garnier's test subjects. Or do you forget the way you once and I can't remember before all I need to do now is find out where Garnier is located. And making it past the guards and now Yep. All right, you son of a bitch. You really, you really want to play with me? Eat shit. Go your burn. Ah, I rest now. Yes, the endless dream calls to me. But before I close my eyes, I must know. What will become of my children? You mean the people made to suffer your cruel experiments? They'll be free now to return to their homes. Homes? What homes? The sewers? The brothels? The prisons that we dragged them from? You took these people against their will. Yes. What little will there was for them to have. Are you really so naive? Do you appease a kind child simply because he wills? But I want to play with fire, father. What would you say? As you wish. Ah. But then you'd answer for his burn. These are not children, but men and women full grown. In body, perhaps, but not in mind. Which is the very damage I sought to repair. I admit, without the piece of Eden, which you stole from us, my progress was slowed. But there are herbs. Mixtures and extracts. My guards are proof of this. They were madmen before I found and freed them from the prisons of their own minds. <sighs> and with my death, madmen they will be again. You truly believe you were helping them? It's not what I believe. It's what I know. Okay, there we go. Yep, okay. I should have known I'd be surrounded here. Well, gonna have to cause some death in order to escape. As much as I really don't want to see myself doing it, 
I have a feeling it's the only thing I can do. And there we go. That should be all of them. Since I have now used the uh, fucking... Since I have now used the fucking... Oh, okay. And... Ah! Oh, fuck! Run away! Get the fuck away from me, you idiots! I have some vigilantes, just in case. Anyways, climbing up the roof. And trying to escape their presence. Ah, oh, fuck. It's alright, it's fine. I use the hay wagon. I have escaped. Even though I am pretty sure they will come after me once again. Yes, they do. So, all I need to do now. Yep, god damn it. No, you won't. Not yet, anyway. Okay. Well, yep. Something tells me this is not going to be pleasurable. Okay. I really need a place to hide. Oh, okay. That one's blocked. Okay. Yep, okay, they are still after me. They are still after me. I am still being chased. Ah, oh, fuck. Come on, make it, make it, okay. Made it! I made it to my hiding spot. All I need to do now is try and make it all the way back to the Bureau. Hopefully no one will see me from here. So, just need to head over here. And, there we go! Garnier is dead. What news, Altair? Gagné is dead. Then you should return to Masayak with news of your victory. There is something else. Speak it then, or would you have me read your mind? What do you think he wanted from these people? That he would keep them an experiment on them as he did? Yours is not to ask, but act, Altair. It doesn't matter what he did or why. Only that he's dead. But Gagné seemed to believe he was helping these people. Is that what you saw? No. What I saw was not a place of healing, but of pain. Then why are we having this conversation? I... I don't know. Forget I spoke of it. I already have. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. So there we go. And... oh. Okay, it's not been obtained yet. There it is. And right before we head on to part two of Memory Block 3, I am officially going to get my thumbnail and end this segment. Target has been eliminated. Return to Al-Mualan. 
Fast forward memory to Messiah. Yes, I will. But there is me ending this segment first. Then I shall do that. So that was Garnier, who is now dead here in Acre, and now we just need to head back to Messiah so we can head over to Jerusalem and where our next target will be called Talal. Coming up next.